So we're here in Birmingham today for the final session of our digital training program. Training up 24 businesses in the city, giving them better digital skills. Around one third of UK small businesses are using the internet in the most sophisticated way that they should. That leaves two thirds that aren't. We think that should be far higher. And we think that there's a huge opportunity for the UK in closing that skills gap. I had no experience at all in digital whatsoever. Most of my business is uh, word of mouth. So I was really keen to try and get with the times, if you like, and get onto the social media side of things. Before this, we weren't exactly sure of where to start. We thought that coding was going to be really complicated. So that's where this training has really come in handy for us. The biggest barrier is, is, is the fear of the unknown. It's not knowing um, where to start, really, but, uh, but also the cost, um, particularly in something like application development. You can spend a lot of money to not get anywhere and, and to find yourself somewhere where you didn't want to be in the first place. The, the practical approach which we've had in this training has been fantastic. We've been learning by doing, which has been the best way for us to learn. Very sceptical to start with, didn't think I'd be able to cope and thought I'd be, you know, crying by the end of the day, but now I really, yeah, uh, I really have sort of warmed to it and the people that have delivered the courses are just absolutely fabulous. Now I feel digital skills are much more approachable. Before I used to think it's only the experts can do it. Tech isn't that difficult to get into. The obstacles were there 10, 15 years ago. But now it's sort of just being told the right websites to go to to make building super, super easy. I think there'd be a huge impact uh, on the nation in terms of small businesses, um, if only to understand uh, websites, applications, um, social media, and how to use it and tap into it. I'm sure businesses would increase their revenue dramatically. The interesting thing about um, business use of digital technology is that if you line up a series of SMEs and, and one business is really taking advantage of digital technology and connectivity, then they will most likely be doing better than the rest. So as much as anything, this is about helping those businesses that don't currently use digital technology to keep up with those other SMEs in their field of work. I think what we're really trying to do is make them realise that the internet makes good things happen for small businesses in Birmingham, in the UK and across the world. I think if we were to pass anything on to the people who we work with, is that you don't have to go and pay someone vast amount of money to do something. That there's enough free resources online um, for you to actually give it a go yourself and just to start experimenting and see what you can come up with. The one tip I would, would do is, is not, not to be scared. If I can do it, anyone can do it. So I think the biggest thing that I'd share with other people is to learn some new skills, see how they work for you and see how other people are using them too because there, there are lots of ideas in that room. Age is no barrier. If you've been in business a long time, that's fine, but um, learn about the new techniques, new technologies, uh, it will help the business. I think we've got to be realistic about what we can achieve with 24 businesses over three weeks. But at the same time, I think we're ambitious about what we can achieve in terms of really getting to understand how these businesses use the training that they've had and understanding how, if that was applied more widespread across the UK, if you extrapolate it out from that, what will be the picture for UK businesses? And we're really hopeful that in three months' time these businesses will have benefited from the training and we'll be able to take to government the message that this stuff really works. You know, learning through doing works, helping businesses to get these digital skills can grow Britain out of the position we're in at the moment.